21 signs you might actually be an ambivert. If you don't feel like an extrovert or an introvert, this might be why. 1. When you're out in the world, you're probably not going to be starting conversations with strangers. 2. Generally, you're always happy to meet new people, but you'll probably feel uncomfortable if you have to do it without any of your existing friends with you. 3. When a topic of interest comes up in conversation, you're more than happy to talk in great detail about it. 4. But as soon as that's done, you'll happily sit listening to the conversation without saying another word. 5. Spending too much time with other people can be exhausting. 6. Your calm, controlled, professional self feels like a very different person to the one your friends see. 7. Asserting yourself is tricky in many situations. 8. You can often go out and have hours of fun being the life of the party, but suddenly find that your energy has dropped and all you really want to do is go home. 9. When you see things written about being an introvert, you start to relate, but then discover that you relate to the extrovert ones as well. 10. In fact, your friends disagreeing about whether you're an introvert or an extrovert is probably a very good sign that you're an ambivert. 11. Small talk is something that annoys you, because while you can do it, there are instances when it feels a bit insecure. 12. Some weekends, you just need to spend some time hanging out on your own. 13. Too much time spent alone can leave you a bit downcast, however, and you're concerned that that's not very productive. 14. And some of the best weekends of your life have been when you didn't go home for three days. 15. Thinking before you speak isn't a problem for you, most of the time. 16. You have a tendency to balance out whoever you're with. If you're with someone loud, you'll be quieter. If they're quiet, you'll compensate for that. 17. You're known to be quite intuitive and good at picking up signals that other people can miss. 18. Often, you just find yourself observing what's happening around you. 19. And at other times, you'll be getting involved in the moment. 20. So in the right context, you love attention, but more often than not, you don't want to be the person everyone is looking at. 21. So if you can't figure out whether you're an introvert or an extrovert, maybe it's because you're actually an ambivert.